Hey mom. What is it, Chris? Can I get some Robux for my account? No. Why not? You failed your previous test in math. I grounded you until you pulled your average in math at least up to a B-. If you want to be ungrounded, do that and study right now. That stinks. You know that. I don't wanna study. I want Robux because there are a few passes I want and Roblox. I'll steal my mom's credit card while she and dad are sleeping. Then I'll buy some Robux for the passes. Now that it is night time, I'm gonna steal the credit card. Now to put this back before I'm caught. All right, kids. Your bus is here. Chris, good luck on that math test. Meg, good luck in that biology test. Thanks, Thanks mom. mom. Hey, Peter, got a minute before you head to work? Sure, Louis. What's up? This morning when I picked up my phone from the nightstand, I saw that I was charged $20 for Robux. I was wondering if that was you by any chance. No, it wasn't, Lois. Check my Roblox account if you don't believe me. I'll take a look while you have a good day at work. It was probably one of the kids. I'll ask them when they get back. Most of you did well on the math test. One of you got another F while the rest of you all got either an A or a B. The one person with an F is none other than Chris Griffin. I have to say, Chris, you're on the verge of having to repeat the ninth grade if you don't get your stuff together soon. You'll be seeing me in detention this Wednesday. I'm sorry to interrupt. Chris is needed in the principal's office. Not at all, Mrs. Tubbs Brown. Also, tell the principal that he has detention with me on Wednesday. Sure. Come on, Chris. It seems pretty urgent. Why are Meg and my mom here? No talking. All you two need to know is that I'm disappointed in the pair of you. I asked Principal Shepard to authorize your early releases so I can punish you both properly. What did we do exactly? Goodbye Griffins. And hello Desk Sandwich. What did we even do this time? We don't know what we did wrong. One of you kids used my credit card to buy Robux without my permission. I want you both to know that what you did is fraud and it's a serious crime. Not only that. By stealing money from me shows me that neither of you can be trusted. We will sit on this couch until one of you respects me enough to tell the truth. Until one of you confesses, you are both grounded. We will wait until your father comes home. You are not to leave this couch until then. I just got back and you both should know that by committing fraud, you can lower our FICO scores and give us plenty of headaches. You brats don't understand what we do to put food on the table and keep the lights on. Your father works six days a week including federal holidays. His work days are 14 hours. He isn't even allowed bathroom breaks and is only allowed five minutes to eat his lunch. You both don't understand the value of a dollar. Back to the matter at hand. Meg was it you? No and this is the first time that I'm hearing about this. Chris was it you? No it wasn't. One or both of you are lying. We will stay here until one of you respects us enough to tell the truth. Did she commit fraud? No. Did your brother steal from me and commit fraud? No. Your grounding time was just extended. And Chris, I know that you failed your math test. Care to explain? I was playing Roblox instead of studying. Why did you do something so carless? I got these new packs. How did you get the packs? 
I used your credit card. Chris Griffin, you're grounded for three months for lying, failing your test and stealing from us. Those $20 are coming out of your paycheck young man. That is once you get a job. Go to your room. I'll be putting your computer in storage later on. Meg, because I pulled you out of school for nothing, you're grounded for two weeks. Go to your room right now.